Hi everybody, it's Brenda here. I've been experimenting with different ways to pour paint. And one of the things I found was pouring through a chain uh, made a really interesting pattern. And so I wanted to try it again with some different colors. So first I'm gonna kinda make my board wet. And I am on a wooden canvas. It's one of our homemade canvases. Um, I painted on top of it with black lacquer, and I see some brush strokes through it, but I think by the time the other layers of paint get on there, it's not going to be a problem. But we'll see. You never know. Things don't always turn out like we planned them. So I'm just going to spread some black paint. And the black paint that I'm wetting my canvas with is not lacquer. It's not enamel. It's more of a flat. But then we're going to have some gloss clear coat on here when we're done anyways. So I'm sure that the different contrasts might be a little bit interesting. And we'll find that out today. I, I like to kind of stay in a beginner's mind that we don't know how everything's gonna turn out. It's kind of like a beginning place to always be with paint pouring. You can't expect too much that it's gonna turn out the way you want because it doesn't. So I'm gonna go ahead and start pouring. I have purple, black, gray, and an off-white. And I have um, coconut milk hair serum in each cup. So I thought we'd go ahead and see what what turns out. So I'll just pour across the top here and I have my board on an angle and I'm hoping that the paint will kind of just flow through the chain links. I might have to lower it a little bit. So, go there let's try it right there I didn't tack the chain down or anything all right here we go let's see what we can do I thought I would just kind of keep alternating the colors and see how they blend together